We're at the US Open Pickleball Championships in Naples, Florida, and I'm here with Megan Fudge and Ryler DeHart. Now, you two met in college playing at the University of Illinois. You guys played tennis. Tell me a little bit about how you transitioned from tennis to pickleball. Yeah, it was a fairly easy transition in some ways, but other ways it was hard. We had to unlearn some stuff, obviously. Can't hit every ball hard and drive every ball, so we had to learn how to dink. Had to learn some of the touch and the finesse of pickleball, so that was obviously a learning curve, but uh, I feel like we've done pretty well with it. So, Yeah, one of the hard things uh, for tennis players to come over is like that we're actually too clean. We're too predictable, too clean looking, people can uh, catch on our tendency too early, so we've had to kind of unlearn a couple of things, uh, get a little bit, um, you know, unconventional, I would say. And you two are newer to the sport. I saw that you learned actually how to play in the pandemic in your driveway. Yeah, that's right. Yes, we, uh, we heard about this pickleball thing um, during the pandemic. We're trying to get outside. We're very, co very competitive. Um, and so we're like, hey, we can draw a court in our driveway. Uh, and all of a sudden, after like 10 minutes of competing with each other, I looked around and our neighbors were looking out the window, watching us and cheering us on. So Probably because of the noise. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it was just uh, super fun, uh, something, a great outlet, uh, great workout, obviously, and just something that we can do together. And how has your tennis background helped you both in this sport? Um, I think it was an easy, easier transition to singles. Um, being able to drive now, the game is obviously getting faster. Uh, people are hitting the ball harder, so you know that helps us because we're used to that with tennis. Um, but yeah, I would say uh, we've been we've been working at it and we've uh, we've transitioned fairly well. But it's been it's been tough as well too. Yeah, I mean, in particular the technique, obviously, uh, from the techni technique standpoint, uh, working on our drives is a lot easier than working on dinks, as Ryla said, working on resets. But uh, yeah, the, obviously the technique in tennis is a lot harder. Uh, coming to pickleball, it's like, okay, we can we can adapt a couple of strokes. We're kind of working on our wrist positions a bit more now in, in the pickleball game, uh, wishing we, we would have played a bit more ping pong. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> but other than that, it's been a, it's been a great transition. And I love your two children are here. That's what makes the sport so fun. You can get the entire family involved and you can watch the U.S. Open Championships online all week on the Pickleball Channel.